So we are at my mum and dad's house because they're on holiday. So we're just here to see Lily, their cat. And so we're going to half look after her this week, call in a few times every day to give her some dinner and things like that. So we're just going to here spend an hour with her. She adores Stuart, so that's the best thing. She's not got fleas, that's just from outside. You secretly love cats, don't you, Stu? No. When Stuart and I first met, he was actually allergic to Lily and used to have really puffy eyes and things. And then, well, because it's my parents' house, we can't not come here. <laughs> so now Stu just has to get on with it. But actually, you quite like Lily, don't you? She's quite an easy cat. We've had her at our house before and stuff, haven't we, to look after. But now, because we've got Blue, it's hard, isn't it? Lily just won't let Stuart not love him, so. <laughs> and she just hates him when he stops stroking her. But she's old now. She's nearly 15. And she's old and she's all bony. So guys, I'm starting to think about holiday prep and I just thought I'd show you what I start to do. So I start to make a list in different kind of categories. So for instance, we're taking blue with us. So this is all the things I'm thinking that blue's going to need, including what we need for when we're out with blue. Um, and then electronics, what I need to take, definitely my handbag on the boat. I need this, all these kind of um toiletry kind of section other bits and bobs at the minute we're thinking about hand gel wipes and tissues um different tablets that we need to take and then i've started to write a list as well about uh, what bits and bobs that we're going to need for the sea for we need to take towels with us hats um clothes and then i am just going to start writing a little list because it's self-catering so if i write a little list of all the kind of bits and bobs we can take with us it doesn't have to be a big bag but um bits and bobs that are just like snacky wise and you know ketchup and things that you don't want to buy a whole bottle while you're down there that would be quite handy so that's what i'm starting to do so i don't know if anyone else does that um i find it quite handy because then i can like tick off so i can go yep yeah, got that tick 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 um as i'm kind of going and i find that really useful so I've just finished work here, it's uh, 3 o'clock, I got here for about half 3, I've been here for half an hour or so, I'm just watching a film, but just need some time with Lil, just so she's not on her own all week. Yeah, it's been a weird day, it really looks really bright out there, but it's been, been really rainy, so it's a long day at work today, it's my first kind of full day in ages, but um, it's alright, work's work, so yeah new toy. Ready, steady, woo. Oh. Cause that's not going to get old fast. Ta. 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 Wild dog. Whoa. Friday evening and it's our last visit with Lily. Mum and Dad come back tomorrow, so we just popped to Tesco's and got them some milk and some bread and things. And it's really stormy, isn't it? It's really like, well, that picture doesn't really show you because it looks really bright, <laughs> isn't it? But um, yeah, it's really stormy and stuff. But Lily's been fine, and um, she's just excited to see us. I think really because she's been a bit lonely, but 
Mum and Dad are back tomorrow, so it's back to normal. So guys, that's it for this week. <laughs> so guys, that's it for this week. I'm just ending the vlog here. Um, as you saw, it was a really bit and bobby week. We were kind of everywhere and doing so many things. So um, we're absolutely shattered. It's Friday night, so I'm just going to end the vlog here. Um, and we've got a bit more of a busier, even so, week next week. So, And we're also going out for dinner next week, so that should be nice. Um, on the new government eat out scheme, because it'll be August. So... I'll take you along to that. Um, so yes, so thank you for coming and watching the vlog. If you've enjoyed, then please consider um, supporting the channel by subscribing and leaving us a like if you have enjoyed. Bye guys. <laughs>